Kamala gearing to make big UNC elections announcement, Day Bay, Trinidad, May 3, 2024. United National Congress, UNC. Political leader Kamla Pasad Bissar SC is anticipated to announce the date for the party's internal executive elections and declare open nominations either tomorrow or Monday. UNC will stage a 35th anniversary South Regional Family Day and Curry Duck Face Off, scheduled to take place at South Ranch, 50A Digity Village, Mohess Road, Day Bay. The party will then host its weekly Monday night forum at Brazil Secondary School on May 6th. Siparia MP Pasad Bissessar has boasted that during her tenure as leader, the party has generally held internal elections within the constitutionally due time frame. The last internal elections were held on Sunday, June 26, 2022. Therefore, it is hardly rocket science to figure out that the approaching elections will be held on Sunday, June 21, 2024, at latest. However, the executive can decide to call the elections at a customary earlier Sunday date, provided sufficient time is catered to facilitate filing nominations, followed by a minimum 21 days period after nomination day to staging the one-member, one-vote polls. An elections committee will have to be appointed by the party to manage the entire process and conduct the polls with administrative support from the party's secretariat. Prominent Port of Spain attorney at law Ramesh Pasad Maharaj had served as chairman of the committee that oversaw the June 26, 2022 UNC internal elections. It won't surprise if he were to be asked to perform the important role again, owing to the professional and efficient manner in which the 2022 elections were conducted. While the election for the post of political leader is not due until 2025, it may also not be a shock either if incumbent Persad Bissessar declare that the party's apex position will also be open for contest. She had done so before in 2015 and 2022. Five dissident UNC members of parliament have been agitating for the internal elections to serve as a mandate for the elected new executive to conduct screening of candidates for the 2025 general elections. The dissidents are Rushton Pere, Orto Ray Mayaro, Rodney Charles, Naparima, Dr. Rai Ragbir, Kumoto Manzanilla, Anita Haynes Tabakit, and Dinesh Rambali Shaguanas. All except Charles have filed nominations to contest their respective seats in the general elections for which the incoming executive will handle the screening process. Pere has publicly stated his intention to challenge for the political leader position when internal elections are held. Rambali, who has the backing of officials of the Sanatan Dharma Mahasabha, SDMS, has also intimated aspirations to lead. Pasad Bissessar's star slate has won every election since 2010 by massive landslides. While the dissident MPs may harbor high hopes of cracking the Kamla Victory Code and bowling her out in the impending Democratic UNC elections, there is little to indicate that they will succeed. With regard to succession planning, the predominant view amongst the broader UNC membership base is that the person best attributed and credentialed to carry the leadership baton when Pasad Bissessar decides to bow out is the lion-hearted Oropush East MP, Dr. Rudal Munilal.